Hey everybody, we are here at Sam's Club. We're gonna go and get Lee some razors because it's a lot cheaper than buying them from Walmart. And Bubba's just had a happy meal. Oh. Hey Bubba. You okay? You good? You wanna take your iPad? Ask Daddy. Daddy! Yes. Let's my iPad. What do you say? Please? Yes, please? Okay, that'll work. There you go. Don't drop Babe, it. Be look at how he's wearing his shoes. I didn't put them on like that. We're at Sam's and it's really packed. I'm gonna see some of the cameras. They have. See if I like one. I think I was seeing the teeth. No, this isn't it. It is so packed in here. We came at the wrong day, which is Sunday. Um, because it, there's tons of people and oh they have 3d class glasses now that are reasonable when we first got our 3d glasses they were like 150 uh, a pair of glasses it was crazy we go through here I want to see um, oh look but they have Bubba's pajamas here for eight dollars Bubba's likes these long pajamas for the winter because they cover his feet, they cover everything, and he's good to go. I like them. I love them. Oh, Lee says that we have to get big ones for all of us, so we all wear them together. So we're probably going to be wearing yeah. that for Christmas. So you all know I will record that. Bubba's has that um, Schwinn bike. That one. It's really nice. We're not going to go through the toy section because Bubba's has been asking me nonstop. But, oh, babe, the iPad mini. Oh, we'll come back because there's people and I want to record. Wait, I'll have him out, but I didn't see the way he came Excuse in. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> he said, there's a crock pot for you. It's ginormous. But, hey, it's a good price because the smaller ones are... Is it cool? That is cool. You'll think there's a pie every day. <clears throat> oh, man, my voice is going. That was weird. Look at how cute these are buy everything I could. Look, babe, this is what we need, because I make lemonade. The thing's huge. It wouldn't fit in the refrigerator. <laughs> oh, crock pot. They got the mini. This is exactly what I want. Exactly what I want. Because I can make my queso dip here, and I can make, like, a roast beef there. That's a good price. I don't know, but I love coffee, and I like that they have, like, organizers and stuff for your coffee. I think that's nice. I think I'm gonna try to convince my husband to get me that crock pot because it's a good deal. These little um, capsules, but they're by carriage or whatever it's called. It's not carriage, babe. It's curry, whatever you call it. Not for 21 and under. Lee is going crazy with the liquor. Look at what they put at in that. them. Isn't that cool? I like that agave. Look at the agave inside. Yeah. Look at this. And then they have like a little cannon thing. That's that is nice. really nice. My grandma would love that. Right? Yeah. We should give her that for the holidays. <laughs> Ooh, there's my stuff. The honey? Whoever hasn't tried this, you gotta try it. If you like a drink in if the winter. If you're 21 and over. Yes, yeah, 21 and over. Gotta be 21 and over. But if you like something in the winter time. For the holidays, yeah. No ice straight up. Just put it in the fridge and chill it. This is the business. We're here at Sam's and there's a new company from Utah that is selling tamales and it's these right here. They're called Chaparros Authentic Mexican Food since 2000. These taste like my grandma's tamales. Not close, wait, but wait, 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 very wait. close. No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's keep it real here, all right? We got to keep it real. They're good, but they're not like your grandma. Of course, nobody can cook like grandma's, Don't get it but it's close. It's very good. Lee, don't say that. They're no, very, it's very good. good. Very good. I would not. Okay, I'm Mexican. I would not have bought them if they weren't close. Listen, they're very good. They're very good. Okay. They're the best we've had that are packaged. Yes. Okay. They're the best that we've had. But your grandma's on another level. Let that be known. They're so good. They're so good, and she's coming for December to cook them. Whoop, whoop. I wish I could send them through you all through the internet, whoop, whoop. <laughs> so you can taste them. Olay here is really cheap and reasonable and I have to say you guys, Olay is really good. If you don't want to spend $100 on a cream, get Olay. Olay Regenerist. 
is the best. I had that line because I wanted to review it. We're getting the soap here. And, uh, and it was really, really good. Legal's crazy at Sam's. He wants to buy the whole store. That's not true. I like the bargain shop. <laughs> I don't like to waste money. I like to stretch it. So some things that, you know, we buy in bulk, I agree with other things. I don't agree with buying if they're just going to sit. Gentlemen, listen to me. For all those who shave with a razor, this is the best deal. Doesn't you have to have card. a Sam's card unless you Doesn't have a friend that has the Sam's card so you could come and get it. 16 cartridges for $43. Well, $44. Yeah, we pay like 20 for 4 at Walmart. Yep. This is it. Right way to go. Also, the soap too, bit. Bubba's, did you find a seat? No. That's too high. You can't sit on that one. You want to get soap? We need soap. We just donated $10 to the veterans because they fought for us and they were outside Sam's Club. So let's remember that we have to make sure we donate even if it's a dollar because they're the reason we are free today in America and we have to appreciate them and what they did for this country. My aunt is a veteran. Lee's dad was a veteran. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. <laughs> so, um, Thanks to everybody that watches us that has served this country. Thank you so much for your service. And it definitely doesn't go unnoticed with us. And we love you. And thank you so very much for doing that. And we're done with Sam's today. It's really, really cold outside. I can't take the cold weather. I love the holiday time. And I love it because that's when Bubba's was born. It brings me such good memories of having him in my arms and just smelling him and holding him. It was just the most amazing day of my life. I'll have to show, I was gonna get teary eyed. I'll have to show you all some videos and pictures and all that good stuff. I don't wanna get into it right now cause I'll break down and I don't want to. Um, but yeah, I love, love, love this time of the year. I just. It gets so cold. I, I can't I can't take it. I like to be warm and cozy. I was so tired working today, so Babe got me some Subway. Yes. And um and I did my nails today for my video really quickly. I used um nails from Sally's. Yeah. They have like a little bit of rhinestones on them, and they're just stick-ons. I really like them. I think they're cute, just for on the go. You can really tell they're stick-ons, but at least they don't look like crap. So. about to watch some TV. I'm going to eat my sandwich. I'm going to let that settle in, take the dogs out, and then I'm going to go to sleep because it's very, very late and I shouldn't be eating this late. But I was working so much today that I didn't get to eat and I'm really, really, really hungry. Just, I didn't straighten up today like I wanted to because all I did was film for tutorial. Look at my beautiful tree. Finally finished that tree. I was so tired. Oh, oh my God, I forgot to show you all. We left um, our ornaments uh, in the outside in our storage, and I put my candles in there. And this is what happens. Look at that. This is what happens to candles when you leave them in the garage. Vegas time. Look at this. Seriously. Look at this one. Are you kidding me? Like, it's donezo. Donezo. I just can't get over this one. I mean, it was so pretty. And look. Uh, uh. <laughs> I'm, all, I'm out of a candle right now. So. so they already came for Coda. And it was bittersweet. But it was really nice to see that he was really, really happy to see his family again. They went on a cruise and they came back in shorts and uh, it was freezing outside. She says it was so hot and humid over there so uh, she came here and found herself a surprise. It was freezing. Um, I was freezing and I had a cardigan on. Um, but maybe we'll get snow this year. We're definitely going to be trying to go take my family because they're all coming um, in December. So God willing. So I want to take them up to Mount Charleston, and there's also a lot of sledding and skiing, right, babe? Oh, yeah. So I've never done it. <laughs> I'm going to try it. I am going to try it. But if I fall and I break something, it's going to be Lee's fault. 
Because mm-hmm. one time, I went to Dallas, and in their in the center of their mall, they have an ice ice skating ice ring. ring, and um, and so I did it. And in that time, I used to wear really really tight pants. I mean, to the point where you had to lay down in order to zip them up because you, you wanted them pants? so tight. Because that was the style. You want to look good. No, why were you wearing tight pants? Because Why anyways, were you can I finish? Wearing tight pants? <laughs> you don't know me then, so be quiet. Oh, um, that's not an answer. Why were you wearing tight pants, babe? Lee, be quiet. Anyways, so I was starting to skate, right? And I thought, oh, it looks so easy. I fell, okay, and there's three floors, so people above you can see you skating. I fell and I tore my pants right on my butt. That's what you get for wearing tight pants. <laughs> And there was guys a floor above filming it. I, I was like, really, thank God there's no blogs in that time. There was like really no, no internet life, I guess you could say. Because um, it just started taking off not long ago. So this was when I was maybe 12, 13, I don't know. Um, so it was such a bad experience. And so now when I think of snow, I don't underestimate the fluffiness. I actually think, holy crap, it's probably going to be really dangerous and I'm probably going to fall and crash into a tree. And then after seeing that movie where the wolves eat the humans, I'm thinking, I don't want to be stuck. And then there's wolves up in the mountains. I mean, it's just crazy. I know it's ridiculous, but you never know. They don't make those movies for nothing. Like in the light, it cools my face. Yeah.